Punch the sky, Spaceman Joe. Yeah. G1, crazy hand. Okay, let's go. In league with the underworld. In league with the devil. Yes. Well, that's not what we're talking about this week on Werewolf Radar's Paranormal News coming For at once. you. But we should be. We should be. That's next week. Okay. I got I got that for next week. This week I have quite a mystery for us. I'm Roger, joined by Jordan and Nate. Hey. That's Jordan, the foul mouth Jordan. I've taken to swearing in these, and I'm not sure why. <laughs> hey, friendos. And good old Wait. friendly Nate. Undid all my hard work. And I I scoured uh, uh, the end of the year for a bunch of news stories, and I thought about maybe doing a uh, compilation of the weird stories that happened over the year. But instead, I stumbled upon this uh, crazy mystery that's happening in Pennsylvania. So Pennsylvania currently is uh, being terrorized by someone – uh, putting mystery notes inside of cereal boxes. Oh, well, uh, I mean, that's the tricks ooh. rabbit. <laughs> <laughs> it's like what he does, right? Uh, we'll, we'll go yeah, into it. Are, and I think uh, the tricks rabbit eats the I mean, cereal. He doesn't no, leave the, a cryptic message in the cereal. <laughs> okay. The lucky uh, Charles Roger. Leprechaun has magical powers of transmutation, sure. whatever. Roger. I can see why you got confused here, but tricks are actually for kids. Oh, I the did. rabbit <laughs> is not allowed to have any and it's killing him. <laughs> so it's I'm re- once. Could you imagine if all you wanted was that easy to fix and just they wouldn't let you have it for some fucking mysterious reason? Just Sorry, why? it's in the branding. <laughs> yeah, well, I mean, uh, that's kind of the same thing. It's just preparing you for health care. Yeah. <laughs> like you'll you'll be the rabbit on the other Fair. side of this one when yeah. you're eight. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. All I need is some sort of treatment. Sorry. <laughs> Healthcare is for the wealthy. <laughs> silly, silly infirmed person. So this story uh is crazy, I feel. So I'm getting it from Pennsylvania homepage.com. Okay. PA homepage.com from the I team, whatever ah. that means. <laughs> the like the letter I or yeah, the, the letter I, I okay. dash team. Yeah, the mystery team. Mystery there note. is an I in this team. <laughs> <laughs> Damn it. All right. Mystery note found in sealed cereal box. This is mm-hmm. from Andy Mahalishik. Mahalshik. Uh, at Sugarloaf TWP, Luzer- Luzerne County. Huh. And it goes oh, as Luzerne such. Luzerne County, is that, uh, is that where the, the, the cheese is originating in? Probably. Hmm. Um, it's a cheese I'm not familiar with. I got a lot Luzerne. of stuff to do before the year ends. So... How did a note get into a sealed cereal box? That's the question, among others, being asked by a Luzerne County man. He has contacted the FBI, uh, the IE team, and local law enforcement to look into the situation. There are a lot of moving parts, as the article says, but we'll go uh, into it. And... Apparently, it's just not this one box. A number of cereal uh, boxes and grocery stores have had mysterious notes found in their product. Weird. Yes, very weird. Uh, The quote from the Luzerne County man goes, I opened up the box. I usually don't open. I usually open up. I usually open it up take the bag out and I open the bag like this. So I poured it out into my bowl and out came this paper that was folded up like this. Joe M- Miller of Sugarloaf Township said, huh? Oh, Sugarloaf Town. Sugarloaf Township. 
Love the article shit. from PA Everybody homepage here. is littered with ads. I did have a picture of the mysterious note. So I'm let me just go to the interweb. I got to know what it says. And I will explain why uh, it looks like this. Sure to drink your Ovaltine? <laughs> <laughs> a crummy commommercial? Is it for like it, uh, that Stussy S? This one right here where it's blurred is the note that people are getting in a lucky charms. Ah. It is blurred uh, because police are asking all media to leave this fact of what it says a mystery until they can find further clues of who is doing this. We got to know what it means. However, it says, however, it is uh, known that the wording is kind of like a jumbled mishmash of okay. words. You see this next one right here. These are random words pulled uh, okay. from it. Okay, so this is uh, this is schizophrenia, is what this is called, <laughs> and somebody's uh, somebody at the at the factory. Although, how are they getting the notes inside? I mean, well, my guess would be that it starts at the factory. They yeah. will go into it. We'll go into it because that's the easy answer that makes the most sense, you know, <laughs> which is not what we're interested in here. <laughs> <laughs> Nor is it the answer, uh, yeah. according to, I think, the the people looking into this mystery as of right now. <laughs> Miller says he couldn't believe what he was seeing. He tells the I team he bought a box of Lucky Charms s'mores cereal at the Luzerne County grocery store on Sunday and Good opened Lord. it on Monday night. Lucky Weird choice. time to eat cereal, S'mores. sir. Perhaps you were stoned. Yeah, obviously. <laughs> I'm Googling this. That is fucking handy, bro. Oh, a breakfast. Candy. I, Look at that shit. I was devastated. I mean, I didn't want I didn't even want to eat the cereal, although I still have the box here. Probably not going to eat it. I don't know what's inside the cereal. Or was this note laced with anything? Miller explained uh, to the I team. At this point, 2822 News, which is a Pennsylvania news affiliate, is not showing the name of the store where the cereal was purchased or the contents of the note as they continue to search for answers. Uh, the letter was a mashup of words and references to current events and various conspiracy theories. Yeah. You're telling me that it wasn't a level, a <laughs> measured level response to current events? It it bothers me, says Miller, that the note is, that the note really, that the note really, it's the note that really bothers me. Wow. These notes are found inside food, like kids' food. <laughs> this know, note the, broke. The bag of Purina child chow. That <laughs> and it, it does, uh, his language there does make it think to where, like, if it, if this note was found anywhere else, like such as dog food, he wouldn't think that much of it. But the, the, <laughs> it would be even crazier to be writing notes to dogs. <laughs> <laughs> Miller contacted the FBI, as did the I team. <laughs> the I team. Get me the I team. An FBI spokesperson had no comment on the note. They were like, look, we look into a lot of shit, sir. Yeah. Yeah. Sorry. I'm busy trying to find some drug dealers right now. Uh, this is a note from a uh, crazy guy is what you're dealing with. But what if it's the Joker? <laughs> and this has been going on apparently for, I think, the past month. Various notes are getting into sealed boxes of uh, of various cereals and not just General Mill cereals, I think. I think it's whoever Gen General Mills is also competing with. I think it's just random cereals. I'm trying to find another article I think, that I had I think open. It could be but... major, major Grindstone. 
General Mills' sworn enemy? <laughs> <laughs> it could be. But I love a good mystery, so I brought this to the werewolf radar bunker for us to talk about, and that's really it as I know of right now. I need to know more of what the note says, but yes. from what you've given me, I can pretty much piece it together. I've seen enough dads on Facebook to tell you, <laughs> to tell you that this right here is someone uh, who has unmedicated schizophrenia, likely got kicked off of Facebook, and now they have sure. to take it take it to the streets. You know, they figured they weren't reaching enough people. Um, this is maybe someone who works at the factory. Uh, I mean, may, maybe it's someone, it, it's either someone who is, <laughs> who needs medical assistance or we've got an Oompa Loompa situation on our hand. You know, I watched Wonka. I saw Wonka. Um, I wish it wasn't as good as it was, by the way. Uh, and, oh, no. uh, the Oompa Loompas, um, I mean, in previous Wonka fiction. Yes. So look. Those of you who don't know, Wonka, most Wonka chocolate is made by an enslaved race of orange people from Limpa Land. OK, so I found a, a letter. So this Usher, please. They're oh, enslaved. Sorry. They're from Limpa Land. <laughs> <laughs> and nobody's doing anything about it. <laughs> Maybe it's because Limpa Land can't be reached by our current INS agents. They wouldn't know where to de deport them to if they could. So that is heartbreaking. And I'm sorry to take time away from that urgent matter. Yeah. I did yeah, uh, I mean, find on Reddit a number of posts that do seem to have the text of that letter. Oh, hit me. Nice. It's I, Again, it's just cra it's going to be crazy. Oh, uh, it's I'm, fucking insane. Let's go Biden to it. Biden crime family filled my butthole with birds. So this has been happening for apparently... Uh, Secret society. Years. Ties to terror. M shot. Can you read it? Oh, there we go. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. This just got. Wow. <laughs> so someone is out there. SS symbols tied to Saturn, God of Time, Lord of the Rings, Toyota's <laughs> RGS. Plot. JFK TikTok. warned. A secret sign. SIS unites SS. They mean secret societies, not the Nazi uh, SS. Okay, okay, yes, okay. yes, yes. Conditioning us to be controlled, incite oh, confusion, division, conflict. Nazis black sun prayer wheel. Something fire about KKK. <laughs> we yeah. got a fire of the KKK, huh? A weird moment of rationalism. Gulf is... crest mobile <laughs> marks. Fauci Oprah shaft. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Symbols Google Bing. <laughs> wow. Yeah, this is uh, this is schizophrenia. <laughs> this is somebody having an episode, typing this out, printing it out. Ooh, hide they either, a tiny race called what? The Oompa Loompas. Yep. It all comes back to Oompa Loompas. Oh, tiny. called Shield. <laughs> it's called Dragon Kings. <laughs> but this um, has been going on for over. I thought it was just a month or so. This has been going on over apparently for more than two years with no culprit found in this weird mystery that only seems to be hitting a community of Pennsylvania. Well, okay, these so notes are coming from the employee of the month. I mean, it's, <laughs> not going to get rid great of Great job. Uh, okay, so if the, if it's inside the bag, it's someone at the at the company. If it's outside of the bag, then that's someone in the town who's like, you know, cutting a slit into the box and slipping it in there. I don't think you can reseal cardboard, but maybe, you know, maybe they're doing maybe they're going so far as to actually like open up the box and then reseal that with glue, which you it always do. seems to be, be folded easier. in a square, like a somewhat neatly folded square, you know. Mm hmm. So uh, there's a lot of possibilities. A culprit has not been found in the two years that this has been happening, and it just seems to be 
ticking up in, in frequency right now. So if you're a Pennsylvania listener and have come across one of these boxes, let us know if what that letter says proper. Let us see if this edition is different than last year. Also, if you're a Pennsylvania listener and you're doing this, cut it out. Get help. You're scaring people. You are scaring people. Did you listen to that man's quote? He forgot English. Let me go over the written. (laughs) He said. He he couldn't finish his breakfast candy. I will say, speaking of Oompa Loompas, my second theory, uh, the thing I was going to throw out there was that maybe it is like a Wonka golden ticket situation, Ah. but you need like a cipher to get (laughs) the ticket. Interesting. If you can decipher this, you get a ticket straight to the fucking batshit topia. I will share the picture of the letter on our uh, Discord. And if you solve the cipher, you can have $5 from mm-hmm. the werewolf radar Five of them. fortune. And Five. these these dollars are different than your currency's dollars. They're mm-hmm. crazy expensive. Yep. It's called it's they're called radar bucks, and they can be used to purchase anything in the werewolf radar store, which is this piece of paper. That's what we're offering in the store right now. <laughs> <laughs> it does make me think: Should we send our own letters out? I think we've either got a, a mentally ill person who needs uh, medication oh, or I think we do perhaps regardless. General Mills is uh, is employing kind of a, a <laughs> situation uh, in their factories. And this is one of them trying to get help for their their family of, you know, their their Oompa wife and their Loompalings, you know, get us out of here. But this is the language they speak. What they if you speak conspiracy theory? <laughs> That's a good one, too. What if. And then we'll wrap up the episode. What if it is a Willy Wonka type situation and whoever solves the cipher gets to become the new general? Oh, geez. The general's looking for an heir. The, the general's heir looking the, for an heir. You heard it yeah. here first on a werewolf radars, paranormal news. Mysterious notes have been left in random serials throughout Pennsylvania for years. Another batch of are popping up if you get one let us know maybe it is a competition and we want you to be the new general we'll help you solve the cipher we'll help you solve the cipher everyone with our cipher king nate nate get good at ciphers real quick all right i'm working on it all right he's working on it let's wrap up this episode start cutting random letters out of bible pages and (laughs) (laughs) that's a good start if you like what we do here and the silliness we create please check us out um wherever you google we got a website we got a merch store we got a twitter we got an instagram we got a threads we got a thingy bobber and a i know what's the doozle doohickey we're everywhere on there but the best ways to really interact with us is our discord you can find the link in our youtube video i believe it's also on our twitter and a few of the social descriptions follow that link join the discord and you can suggest topics for us enjoy paranormal discussion Discussions that we have, news that we share, video games we talk about, the whole shebang of bang. It's a fun community. We also uh, need five star reviews. Give us five star reviews. We feed on them. We need them. It's the best way to they support the us. show. Yeah, you have so many stars. Why are you holding on to them? Mm-hmm. Hoarding stars. You're a million star baby, baby. <laughs> give those star, give those stars out. To the podcast that you enjoy wherever you can. Your mother and I have been meaning to talk to you about this. You have too many stars. Yes. And Jordan just wants to be there for you. He's not looking to replace your real dad. Nobody can replace your real dad. Hell, we can't even find him. (laughs) (laughs) I'll tell you what might replace him. Brand new PlayStation 5, huh? (laughs) <laughs> if you care to even more so though check us out at patreon.com forward slash werewolf radar where you can give us a small financial pledge support the radar and making it run and work efficiently uh, and help us grow into real podcasters that do this as a job just not as a fun collection of thoughts we have to scream out because the darkness controls us every sunday 
Could you imagine? Could you imagine that? If we did this for fun and profit versus the command of the dark place? We'd be unstoppable. Us together, you and us. Patreon.com forward slash Werewolf Radar. And you'll get an exclusive episode, early access to the news, and uh, other paranormal goodies. We just did a new shirt by, and new shirt and art and mug. Uh, from one Jordan doll. Mm-hmm. So check out that. We also have a merch store where you can get the shirt. I think I'm moving the mug there, but that takes time and I got distracted by work. Hell yeah. Did we launch the mug? Or are we going to do, or is this the soft launch? This is the soft launch. We're not full mug club yet, but we're getting there. We'll be, we'll be mug club in no time. All right, everyone. Let's wrap up this siddling as enter the real episode. On the count of three, our super duper secret sign off line from one Dylan Gutierrez. Um, Dark Council member extraordinaire. One, two, two, three. three. The launch the mug. The launch the mug club. club. Yeah. Space persons, whomever. <laughs> <laughs>